Hey guys, we are in the camper today because weather's just not cooperating with me. So I'm going to try to finish this bad boy up. So the canned ham, the vintage camper, we're going to work on it. What's up everybody? The weather's been crazy. I mean, it has rained here for three weeks straight almost every day my videos have been I've been trying to come up with ideas do stuff inside I don't have weatherproof equipment but I want to finish this thing up if you're new to the channel I got a whole playlist of this this is a 1963 Yellowstone camper got it from a hunting club it was in very bad shape we totally gutted it and repainted it done the inside and I'm almost through with this thing kind of messy right now probably I can't remember my last camper video but it's been a while it's been a while we've done a whole lot since then all the all the electricals done the cabinets are all put in refrigerators in uh, the couches there's the table that goes in the middle here I got painting I got left to do I got touch up this right here and paint this I had to take this down because we had a, a chandelier but it had a beautiful vintage chandelier here but we noticed when we took it down the road to go get this uh, window checked out in the door the chandelier just swung all over the place I just went with an old generic light maybe one day I can change this out but whatever it's got to be in here has got to be flush mounted so I had to pull this piece back down so that I could get this new light in. I got to recalk it and fill the screws in and paint it. I want to paint clouds on the ceiling. I got to paint this strip here. The original had, it was quarter inch plywood for you to sit on. And I'm guessing people in the 60s must have been way smaller than we are. Cause that just wasn't going to work. You sat on it and almost broke through. So I came back and put three quarter inch plywood in for us to sit on so this actually turns into a bed well here's the original piece so when you put the the table lays down and it's two pieces of wood that go here it was all three quarter of an inch too short so I figured you know when you're laying down you're gonna feel that three quarters of an inch so I added this new strip here to raise it up so I gotta caulk and paint this too uh, I had to put a strip back here in the back last night I caulk, got, a, got it caulked just gotta paint it I put the trim work in I got a wall here that's got and it needs another coat of paint on it I ran the trailer lights uh, yesterday um, we have installed an air conditioner probably since I've done a video it's uh but it's not permanent it comes out so then that little sucker will run you out of here but that's what I'm gonna do today that's gonna be the video today is is the camper update and uh, getting this camper totally finished <laughs> We're taking the camper tomorrow to get the window put in. And the air condition is just temporary. I mean, temporary. It's just, you know, just when we park and stay. That's what it's in here for. I don't think I could ride down the road with it in there. Skid or fall. So I got to take this out. We're going to take it and get the window put in. Getting closer. <laughs> put this air conditioning in like two months ago. Now I gotta remember how I did it. Now to put the window back in. Now I got to try to figure out how this thing goes back in. That's the, oh, that's got to go. Got 
got the window in. Now we can put this, take this bad boy on the road and get this. Hopefully it'll work because we're having a hard time finding the molding that goes around it. Because the door's so thin. My buddy at the glass company. Thanks, he, he thinks he's got it this time. So got it hooked up. I'm going to take it on. And hopefully tomorrow when I record, I'll have, I'll have a window in this thing. If the window's in here, it'll be 100% weatherproof. We're already planning our first trip in it. Um, we do we do want to eventually try to use it to uh, to sell our stuff out of, like at farmers market or at events. Use it as a booth. Also, we're gonna use it to actual camp out of too. So we're probably gonna camp out in it here at the house. Make sure everything's okay before we're on the road. So we'll give it a test run in 24 hours. Hopefully, we'll have a window on it. So when I start shooting again. Fingers crossed there's a window in here. The next day. Got the bad boy at the glass company. Hopefully, we'll get the glass put in today. Penny, you have already laid an egg. Are you broody? I don't think so, but whatever she is, she thinks she got a light novel, but she can't. She is crazy. We did get it back. The window worked. The mold and window all worked perfect. Worked good. So we got a window in the door now, so that's fixed. So we are getting so much closer. But I wanted to show you the cushions that we have made. These are actually, we're pretty sure this is the original foam cushion. We just had it covered. The only thing that I got really left to do is, is undercoat the underneath. And I like putting the, the, uh, the sink in. We got just a cold faucet only. And we're going to put it in and a drain. I'm thinking about, I think I may have talked just about this before. I know I have, but I think I'm just going to put like a, a bucket with a lid on it. With the pipe going in it, and that's where the uh, the water's gonna drain down into, and then we can take it out and drain it. But you can see it looks looks much much better now since I cleaned it up. Much better now since I cleaned it up. Go back. If you haven't seen all the videos, go back because this is like number six or seven. I have to go back and look. But this is the this is this is either number six or seven video I've done on this. You can see what this thing looked like before before we got started on it because it was in bad shape. I hope y'all like this video. I can't. I just haven't been able to get outside and do anything. Do anything outside that we should be doing around here. It's during weather. It rained. It has rained for over three weeks straight. It, I know it hadn't rained every single day, but it has rained, I bet you, 80% of the time. Then, Tropical Storm Cindy just came through, and she just dumped a ton of rain. As soon as I can get back outside, I'll get all y'all caught up. But in the meantime, you guys have a wonderful day. If you like the video, give us a, give us a like, and... Y'all be good. Any questions or comments about the Can Ham or Venice Camper, please ask me. I'll try my best to answer them. And hey, we'll just catch y'all on the next one. You guys be good. She's very strange. I don't know what she is doing, but she's very funny. Bye bye, Penny.